My dear children, this is the second video lesson based on process of excretion. In the previous video, we learned about how the excretion occurs in human body. Uh, in this video, we expect to discuss three diseases associated with the uh, excretion system, especially uh, urinary system. Uh, these are the diseases that you are going to discuss renal failure, nephritis, calculi or stones in kidney and bladder. These three diseases are very common among people uh, even in Sri Lanka. Renal failure. Weakening of urine filtration process in nephron is renal failure. You know nephron is the structural unit and the function unit in the kidney. Due to weakening of uh, urine filtration process in nephron, the renal failure occurs. This occurs mainly due to uh, infections by microorganisms or sometimes uh, getting the heavy metals or toxic metals into your body like mercury, arsenic uh, or insecticides and various medicine which contain carbon tetrachloride these chemicals may cause renal failure the basic symptom is oedema and increase of blood pressure due to accumulation of water and salt in the body and in the tissue fluid, the blood pressure increases. In the meantime, the pH of the blood, the acidity of the blood increases. The pH value decreases, that means the acidity increases due to accumulation of urea and other excreted matter because urea is not filtered, it is acidic. So the acidity of blood increases. However, this condition can be controlled by immediate uh, treatments and you can uh, get the functions reversed. If the treatments are not taken immediately, the person uh, get into acute renal failure condition acute renal failure condition it is an irreversible condition you can't get the kidney function back then the person will have to uh, purify the blood by using external machine the process we call as the dialysis machine the dialysis or if both kidneys are failed by this manner the person will have to go for a kidney transplant from another donor. Another very commonly uh, reported disease associated with the extra system is nephritis. Nephritis means swelling of kidney due to infections or toxic matter due to microbial infections or toxic matter, the kidneys uh, swell. The reason for nephritis is infections in the ureters and uh, other changes in the body. During this uh, condition, the glomerulus of the nephron of the kidneys are affected and sometimes the urinary ferrous tubules are affected. Due to the damages in glomerulus, the volume of blood flows through it reduces. You know, inside the glomerulus, the filtration takes place, ultrafiltration. When the glomerulus get damaged, the filtration decreases. So the amount of urine pass the particular person reduces 
that is the main uh, symptom the person would face the amount of urine pass drastically decreases at an nephritis condition as the urine is not passing and the filtration doesn't happen properly the waste materials remaining within the body and toxic matter remains in the blood and not only that as the glomerular filtration doesn't take place properly the pressure increases and as the pressure increases some proteins may get filtered into the glomerular filtrate essential proteins so the person would face into conditions like stroke medical advice should be taken immediately for this condition third and the last disease uh, that you are going to discuss is calculi or stones in kidney and blood it is very common among people in sri lanka stones in kidney here yeah, not the granite stones or uh, quartzite like stones these are calcium oxalate crystals forming in the kidney or blood calcium oxalate these calcium oxalate crystals blocks the ureter and the person feel a terrible pain because the amount of urine pass decreases and the urinary ureter blocks the person feels a severe pain these stones can be removed by using drugs or by a surgery at present when these uh, stones are too big a special technique called lithotripsy technology is used to crush these stones so that it can be passed through the ureter when the stones is so big stone is so big by using ultra wave sound or directing ultra wave sound or shock wave into this stone it is crushed and break into small pieces and uh, let it pass through ureter it has not by some uh, reasons for the condition postponing of urination it is very common among the school uh, children when you want to pass the urine and you have to do so you have to remove it you should not postpone the urination and you have to drink sufficient amount of water your water uh, to minimize the condition like calcula and you should not avoid to acidic to salt to spicy food press on the screen is how the uh, stones in kidney are crushed by using a shock wave ultra sound shock wave after the shock wave is directed the uh, stones in kidneys rock and down small pieces then it can pass through this uh, ureters children uh, we have come a uh, lesson on excretory system or the process of excretion in my next video i hope to discuss the process of blood circulation now you can answer the past papers questions and the questions uh, based on this uh, lesson given in your textbook do them and brush up your knowledge and be prepared for your easy all level examination goodbye children